is the Tad Show. Oh, what a... <laughs> You're at 17%. That... Excuse me? You're at 17% of the votes. Out of how many percent? Out of uh, 100. <laughs> what place am I in? Third. That sucks. Third out of three. No, third out of four. Yeah. They don't remember me, dude. You got kids. First of all, Cesaro. Who's winning, Cesaro or Brock? Uh, Brock Lesnar's at 45%. Cesaro's at 26%. Okay. Now, let me give you my honest opinion on this whole orchid aside, this whole gut-wrench suplex thing. And Look, I've, uh, I've done a lot of gut-wrench suplexes. I've done a ton of suplexes throughout my whole career. Everybody knows that. But... Honestly, gut wrench. I, I didn't do a ton of gut wrenches. I didn't do a. I didn't do a gut wrench a lot. If I was going to pick someone out of these four people between Taz, Becky Lynch, Brock Lesnar, and Cesaro, I would pick Cesaro. To be honest with you, he does a gut wrench. I think he's stapled as a guy who does a lot of uh, does his gut wrench suplex a lot. I would also the Iron Sheik. I think should have been on there. Sheik used to do uh, gut wrench a lot. Um, I would definitely put him in there. So, uh, but I definitely think in current modern or the four folks, including me, that were named, I humbly, not humbly, I sorrily say, sorrily. Did you hear what I just said? Sorrily? S-O-R-R-Y Lee. I think there's two R's in there. Right. So, I uh, unfortunately say that I don't think I should win anyway. That's me taking the high road as usual. Because Cesaro is known. As a guy with his gut wrenches, if you really know the business. But if you're some kid that's in sixth grade and you see a tweet with the word suplex and you see Brock's name, right away, Brock is the guy. Because that's what they know. Who's this Taz guy? GTS him. I don't know, Johnny. Who is he? Hey, some old guy. Short guy. With a mohawk. Oh, okay. Is it onesie? Is it twosies? <laughs> What's going on here? Yeah, they're confused. <laughs>